it's me, Miss Candace. Welcome back for another episode of Hangouts with Hank. Let's give him a call and see what he's been up to this week. <laughs> oh, hi. Hey, how are you? Oh, I'm doing great. How are you today? It's so great to see you. Oh, I <laughs> got my sunglasses on. Whoops, I was outside earlier. Oh, me too. I went on a nature walk. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Hey, speaking of outside, we can do our activity for today. Great idea. So earlier this week, Hank and I had a phone call with each other, and we decided to play the nature game. Now, the nature game can be anything you want it to be. But for Hank and I, we like to go on the nature hunt, and we like to walk outside, and you can go for a walk or just stroll around your yard or go for a hike. And you look around and you just pay attention and notice the things around you. And then the goal is to look for things that are interesting to you, to pick them up, and then to make something really cool out of them, and then to come up with a story to go with your object. I have something great. I can't wait to see it. I'll get mine too. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm right here. Oh, I can't wait to show Hank. I think he'll love it. You ready? Mm-hmm. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I what call him he? Super Pod Man. I love him. What's his story, Hank? Well, he's made out of pods from a tree mm -hmm. in my backyard. And, well, he's super because he flies around and he waters all the flowers. So he yeah, has a little watering can awesome. right there. <laughs> we need yep, that's Super Pod power. Man. Yeah. We do, because we need to keep yeah. watering all of our flowers that we've been planting. <laughs> yeah. Are you ready to see mine? I'm ready. Okay. This is what it looks like. Da, 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 da. If you look what? closer, you'll What's see that? some gems. This yeah. right here, Hank, is very magical and whimsical and fantastical. Mother Nature uses one of these. This wow. is a weather wand. How's it work? Well, I just point it in the direction of the weather, like the sky, and I say, make it sunny, and I pretend that the sun comes out. Da -da -da -da. Magical weather wand. I like it. <laughs> Thanks. I like yours, too. Thank you. <laughs> hey, do you know what I realized when I was looking for things? Oh, oh what'd you realize? I realized that my favorite place to be is outside. Oh, I love going outside. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's so much fun. And did you know that it's not only fun to go outside and be in nature, but it's also super good for us, too? Really? Yes. It's good for your body. Oh, that's where I get my 60 minutes of exercise. That's right, Hank. We should be getting 60 <laughs> minutes of exercise every single day. That yeah. means we really need to make sure that we're moving our bodies every single day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah. So being outside is helpful for our bodies because it gets us moving, right? Did you ever walk into an open field and just start running? I have. That's I a lot of fun. I love doing that, right? When we're outside, we learn to use our bodies differently. Run faster, jump higher, climb trees. I love climbing trees. <laughs> Me too. It's super good. And it helps us get stronger both in our muscles and our bones. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you know what? Thing? Did you know yeah. that that big burning star in the sky, do you know what it's called? The sun. The sun is good for us too. <laughs> Did you know that? It is really? Yes. Do you know well, the feeling wear, like, of the sun sunscreen? On your... What was that? Well, I thought I was supposed to wear sunscreen so I didn't get burnt. You definitely are supposed to wear sunscreen. But you're also supposed to be out in the sun with your sunscreen. We oh. our skin soaks up the warmth of the sun and it actually gives us vitamins. It helps our body make vitamins that help keep us <laughs> healthy so that we can fight wow. off those bad germ bugs. You know, I have a friend who loves going outside in nature and she loves yeah. birds and trees and squirrels and flowers and all that stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah? It's Miss Karen. You're right. Miss Karen loves to go on hikes and walks around her neighborhood. She loves to look at birds and animals. Yeah. Um, Hank, should we give her a call? 
Great idea. All right, let's bring her in. I can't wait to talk to Miss Karen. <laughs> hi, Miss Karen. Oh, hi. hi. How are you? It is great to see you. Nice to see you guys. <laughs> so what are you doing today? Well, right now I'm sitting outside in the park. Wow. We knew, we knew that you would be somewhere outside because you love being outside. What kinds of things do you like to do outside? Oh boy, I love taking hikes. I love taking walks. Sometimes I just like to sit outside and get some fresh air. <sighs> That's a great idea. That oh, sounds amazing. You know that when we get fresh air from outside, that nice clean fresh air filling our lungs, <sighs> it actually helps our bodies calm down and feel a little less stressed. Really? Mm-hmm. Whoa. That's pretty cool. So you like to go to the parks and to different hiking trails. Um, what other things can we do outside? You said that you like to sit down on the ground. What kind of activities can we take outside? Yeah, so I like to be mindful when I'm outside. Hmm. So being mindful just means noticing what's around us and using our senses. So when I'm outside, I like to go to the same place um, often to see how it changes. So I use my sense of sight to look around and see what maybe new flowers are blooming or if there's any animals around. It's really cool to see how the same place changes through time. That's a great idea. That I like sounds like fun take, too. I like to take all of my like daily activities outside if I can. Things like reading and drawing. You could do those in those places. Yeah, definitely. I love reading outside and I feel so great at the end of the day when I have some, have had some fresh air. Me too. Me mm -hmm. too. Mm-hmm. Hmm. So what else can we do outside? We talked about how soaking up the sun is pretty good for us. It helps our bodies make vitamins that keep us strong and healthy. Um, what else can we do outside? Hank, do you have any ideas? I know that you love to be outside. Oh, I know. Um, mm -hmm. We can play tag and hide and seek. I love and we can playing play games. Amateur hunts. Yes, that's a great idea, Hank. We can do different games like hide and seek and tag. I love that. Totally. Yeah, <laughs> that's a lot of fun. It is really Super fun. fun. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I like to stretch, too. Just stretch my body. Oh, can we do a stretch now? Let's do a stretch. Sure. What stretch should we do? Why don't we reach our hands up to the sky? Ooh. Ah, feels so good. That's oh. a good one. I <laughs> like it. <laughs> That's another yes. activity that you sometimes do inside, but you can take it outside. I love There's so ideas. much room outside. There really is. <laughs> Thank you so much, Miss Kara, for sharing the ways that you are mindful outside in nature. You're welcome. I wanted to share one more thing. Okay. Oh, what do you have? Oh, what I love to do is listen for the sounds. So sometimes I hear a bird and then I can follow my, my ear and maybe find the bird that's making the sounds. I it's love It's so that fun. Idea. Hmm. Yeah, it's really fun. That's and thinking good. about how all of the things around us are alive, like all the plants and the animals and the insects, all those things are alive, just like us. You're right. It's so that is yeah. what we need to think about. Yeah. Thanks, Thanks for, for letting me share. Thank you so much for sharing. We hope to talk with you soon. Okay, sounds good. See you later. See you later. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love talking to Miss Karen. I really miss her. Me too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so she kind of made me think about lots of different things that we can do outside. And yeah. She made me realize that being outside is really good for our bodies, but it's really super good for our minds and spirits too. Yeah. You know what? I think I'm going to go back outside for another walk. <gasps> That's a great idea. I think I might do that too because but we can this help time? clear our minds. We can be still. We can yeah. focus on what's around us and using our senses and really just be in the moment. And this time, mm -hmm. I'm going to look for all kinds of signs of spring and summer. 
<gasps> yep. That's a great idea. Yes, summer's coming up. So there are little signs peeking up everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> One of my favorite signs of summer, you can usually see at night. Do you know what it is? Oh, um, what's that? Well, I'll give you some hints. There are little tiny bugs that glow. Oh, I've seen those before. Yeah, I call them fireflies. It? Yes, I <laughs> love those so much. But that's a sign of summer, but that they yeah. come out at night. All right, Hank. Um, let's see here. So we should spend a little bit more time outside. Yep. Um, and we can take our inside activities outside. But did you know that it's also a great idea to bring nature indoors, especially for like really? rainy days? Yeah, like good this idea. Right here. My little tree. You can bring oh, little I like your pieces. Cheese. Thanks. You can bring little <laughs> pieces of the outdoors inside. I like to bring in rocks and stuff like that to look at, maybe make art out of. Hmm. And it's it's especially good when it's rainy outside and we can't always be outside in the in the fresh air. So we can bring little bits inside too. Great idea. Thanks, Hank. Um, do you think you could give me a joke? Oh, I have a great joke. Yeah. What did the tree wear to the pool party? What did the tree wear to the pool party? Yeah. I have no idea. Trunks. Oh, <laughs> like swimming trunks. I love that, Hank. Yeah. And the trunk I like tree, tree trunks. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great one, Hank. All right, Hank. I think that I'm going to be with you and go outside right now. I'm going to take great idea. some books and a blanket and cozy up under a tree. But before I leave, should we have a dance party? Absolutely. Okay. All right, let me get the disco ball. Ooh. And dance. Oh, I like that move, hey? Okay? <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. I'll see you next time, Hank. See you later. See you later. Bye-bye. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for joining us for another episode of Hangouts with Hank. We hope to see you next time. Thanks for hanging with us.